Mr. and Mrs. Owen Leifer. I told you if we dance in the blizzard, we are not getting cold. So keep on dancing, baby. For our wedding, my fiance wanted to ski down after our mountaintop ceremony in Jackson Hole, but I was pretty worried that doing the whole ski thing might turn it into a super sporty ski wedding. And I didn't want all of our photos to look like we were just having a sort of fancy ski day. I wanted a fun wedding feel. So I talked to the photographer that we got about the vibe I wanted. My fiance scouted out some shots he wanted on the mountain and I did these things. I got my full hair and makeup done. We wore nice shoes instead of ski boots. I skied down in my dream backless and strapless wedding dress. I wore a fur jacket instead of a puffy. I had a girl crew come up the tram with me since we didn't have bridal parties. I got two different bouquets, a dainty one to walk down the aisle with and a more bold one to ski down with. We made sure our boots, skis, and poles were all black and white so they all looked cohesive with our theme. We got dark sunglasses instead of goggles. We had a bunch of our guests ski down with us and we had an epic photographer to capture insane photos all day long on the mountain. Here is how those photos turned out. Are going for a little hike out here in the winds. Got one of our best charcuterie setups yet. Owen surprised me by bringing this ring and two small bottles of champagne 10 miles into the backcountry for a camping weekend. He said he wanted a photo of us and put his camera on self timer and that's when he got down on one knee. To rewind, we met playing sand volleyball four years prior and connected over our excitement for all types of adventures. We both work for ourselves doing what you see there, so our days revolve around a beautiful combination of work and play. We're pretty much obsessed with traveling the world and experiencing all the adventures life has to offer. A few months after we got engaged, we finally started planning our wedding and realized if we wanted to have a ski wedding at our home resort, Jackson Hole, we'd have to make it happen by the first week of April, which is when they close. And that was only three months away. As an artist, I of course had a lot of DIY ideas I wanted to make happen, so I had to get started. First, I watercolored our postcard invitations with the vibe I wanted for our wedding, and we got them sent out to people so they could get their flights. Then I illustrated this graphic to use on our menus, which we had printed on vellum, and also had the graphic printed on our silk silicone wine glass wedding favors. For the table centerpieces, I wanted the pillar candles to be subtly on theme, so I painted skiers going down them. And then my dad cut a bunch of slices of wood for the candles to sit on, and Owen drilled tiny holes all around the outside so that we could insert simple preserved florals into them. And then we scattered preserved rose petals and eucalyptus leaves all around everything. Once the candles were all lit, I love how it turned out. Our cake was made by my favorite cake artist in town, and she took inspiration from my candles to make this awesome cake. The flavor combo was chocolate espresso, Wyoming whiskey, and salted caramel. We also got a variety of mini cookies from my favorite bakery, which also happened to be my first job I had when I moved to Jackson. We decided to do long tables and seating assignments for our 75 guests, and it worked out perfect. For our ski down, we didn't buy any new ski gear. We just repurposed our old stuff. I painted my old yellowing ski boots with white house paint. From a distance, they were absolutely perfect. We bought sticky vinyl to cover our ski graphics and I hand lettered bride and groom on them. They served as a simple frame for our ceremony and looked cute to ski on. And then we spray painted our poles black and white. It was super cohesive and made the photos epic.
I am so excited for our endless adventures together. You are the love of my life, and I will strive to be the best husband I can be. Yes, I feel so lucky to have found someone who is just as excited to play around the world on a whim as I am. So today I make the following vows to you. Very difficult. <laughs> I take you as my wife. As my wife. Okay. Owen, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Owen Leifer! for all brides. Yes, it's next year's ski outfit. Really, really <laughs> dreams, but somehow both of you have this special thing of making work turn into play. And I love you. Our bodies move to the groove and the light the flickers. We get lost in the crowd, it's getting thicker. We get away, get away from the drinks and chatter. Haven't said a word, but it doesn't matter. Feel the air again. Standing in a blurry dream No one else can see her. Live your life within the moment, moment And don't go wait until the morning, morning You'll never know when it is over, over All that I know is we'll get older, older So let us dance this side away 
in a blurry dream No one else can see us So let us dance this night away